My garden, my garden is a little piece of heaven. <laughs> it is uh, mature, it's full of wildlife and my bees are at the bottom of the garden. I'm, I'm big into uh, nature and uh, outdoors and uh, um, uh, moving to the country, uh, bees were a natural progression. Uh, at the moment there are uh, three full hives and three split hives waiting on uh, queens hatching and mating. To me it's Sunday morning, weather's fine, bees are happy, there's a peacefulness, it's a calmness, it's a, it's a real relaxation. There's really very few other places I would rather be and spend that time. An artificial swarm is one of those unfortunate situations, but it is necessary. They tend to build up a hive to a, 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 a maximum, and Queen will take all the flying bees. So. Uh, to try and prevent that happening, you do an artificial swarm to try and keep your uh, your queen and your flying bees. Uh, it's like splitting your colony, it's like losing it's like losing that colony that you've nurtured, that is built up. They then um, are, are going to fly off, they're going, they're going to swarm. 